Menachem Mendel Schneerson, September 9, 1789, 29 Elul 5549, March 17, 1866, 13 Nissan 5626, OS, also known as the Zemek Zedek, was an Orthodox rabbi, leading 19th century Posik, and the third Rebbe, spiritual leader of the Chabad Lubavitch Chassidic movement. Topic: <inaudible> Biography. <inaudible> <inaudible> The Zemek Zedek was born in Liazna, on September 9, 1789. His mother Devra Leah died just three years later, and her father Rabbi Schnorr Zalman of Liadi raised him as his own son. He married his first cousin Chaya Mushka Schneerson, daughter of Rabbi Dubber Schnori. After his father-in-law, uncle's death, and a three-year interregnum during which he tried to persuade the Hasidim to accept his brother-in-law Menachem Nahum Shnori or his uncle Chaim Avraham as their leader, he assumed the leadership of Lubavitch on the eve of Shavuot 5591 May 5, 1831 OS. He was known as the Zemek Zedek, Righteous Sprout, or Righteous Scion, after the title of a voluminous compendium of Halakha Jewish law that he authored. He also authored Derek Mitzvatecha, Way of Your Commandments, a mystical exposition of the mitzvos. He compiled major works of Rabbi Schnorr Zalman of Liadi for publication, including the Siddur Lakal Hashanah, commonly known as Siddur Im Dak, Likute Torah, and Torah Or. He also authored a philosophical text entitled Sefer Chakira, Derek Amuna, Book of Philosophy, The Way of Faith. The Zemek Zedek enjoyed close ties with other Jewish leaders. In the course of his battle against the Haskala in Russia, he forged a close alliance with Rabbi Yitzchak of Valazhin, a major leader of the Misnagdom, which led to warmer relations between them and the Hasidim. According to Baruch Epstein, his father Rabbi Yeshiel Michel Epstein spent six months under the Zemek Zedek's tutelage, and learned most of his mystical knowledge during that time. This story is disputed by Hasidic historian Yehoshua Monshine. His close friendship with Professor J. Burstenson, the Tsar's court physician, often helped the delicate negotiations relating to the welfare of the community. He set up an organization called Hevris Teki Hamazim to assist Jewish boy soldiers who were being recruited and converted to Christianity by the Russian army. These soldiers known as Cantonists were taken away from the Jewish community to other villages. Schneerson arranged for his students to pay them regular visits to keep up their spirits and discourage them from converting. In 1844 45, he took steps to increase the enrollment and viability of the Lubavitch yeshivas in Dubruna, Pasana, Lyazno, and Kalish, expanding their enrollment to around 600 students in total. Repeated attempts by the authorities to entrap him using informers such as Herschel Hodesh, Benjamin the Apostate, and Lippmann Feldman failed. Death and legacy He died in Lubavitch on 13 Nisan 5626 March 17, 1866, at the age of 77, leaving behind him seven sons and two daughters. He was succeeded by one of his youngest sons, Shmuel as the Rebbe of Lubavitch, while three of his other sons formed breakaways of the Chabad movement which continue to some extent even today. Several of his sons established Chassidic dynasties. See hashtag sons. Topic. Famous quote A famous saying of the Zemek Zedek is think good and it will be good original Yiddish, tract gut vet zian gut. This expresses the Chabad view that simply by virtue of a person's trust in God, that person's prayer may be answered. Topic. Sons The Zemek Zedek had seven sons, one. Rabbi Baruch Shalom did not become a Rebbe in his own right, he chose to remain in Lubavitch and become a chassid of his youngest brother. Rabbi Menachem Mendel Schneerson, the seventh Rebbe of Chabad Lubavitch, was his great-great-grandson. Two. Rabbi Yehuda Lieb Schneerson Maharal 1808-1866 settled in Kopis a few months after the death of his father, where he founded the Kopist branch of Chabad. He died two months later. He had three sons. 
Rabbi Shlomo Zalman Schneerson (1830–1900), oldest son of Rabbi Yehuda Lieb, assumed his father's position in Kopist. He is the author of a work on Hasidism titled Megan Avot, Shield of the Fathers. Rabbi Shalom Dubber Schneerson of Richitza, d. 1908, known as the Rishab of Richitza. Succeeding his brother, Rabbi Shlomo Zalman, Rabbi Shalom Dubber served as the Kapister movement's Rebbe in the town of Richitza. Rabbi Shalom Dubber seems to have died without a successor. Rabbi Shmaryahu Noah Schneerson (1842–1924), known as Shmaryahu Noah of Babruz. Succeeding his brother, Rabbi Shlomo Zalman, Rabbi Shmaryahu Noah served as the Kapister movement's Rebbe in the town of Babruz. He was Rav of the Chassidim in Babruz from 1872, and founded a yeshiva there in 1901. He authored a two-volume work on Hasidism, titled, Shemin Lamaor, Light for the Luminary. Point 3. Rabbi Chaim Schneer Zalman was Rebbe in Liadi after his father, the Zemek Zedek died. He founded the Liadi branch of Chabad. He was succeeded by his son, Rabbi Yitzchak Dovber of Liadi, author of Siddur Maharad, and his son-in-law, Rabbi Levi Yitzchak D. 1905 of Saratan, a scion of the Rebbe of Radzimin. 4. Rabbi Yisrael Noach of Najin founded the Niezhin branch of Chabad. Although officially a Rebbe, he had only a small following. He had no successor. His son was Rabbi Avraham Schneerson of Kiskanef, whose daughter, Nakama Dina Schneerson, married Rabbi Yosef Yitzchak Schneerson, the sixth Rebbe of Chabad Lubavitch. 5. Rabbi Yosef Yitzchak was a Rebbe in Overich. He founded the Avruch branch of Chabad. He was compelled to assume this position by his father-in-law, Rabbi Yaakov Yisrael of Cherkas, son of Rabbi Mordecai of Chernobyl and son-in-law of the Middler Rebbe, against his father's wishes. He was the maternal grandfather and namesake of Rabbi Yosef Yitzchak Schneerson, the sixth Rebbe of Chabad Lubavitch. 6. Rabbi Yaakov, although leaving descendants, died at quite a young age. He lived in Orsha. Little is known about him. 7. Rabbi Shmuel Schneerson Maharash of Lubavitch, his youngest son, succeeded him as the Rebbe of Lubavitch. <laughs> or Hadera Rabbi Menachem Mendel Schneerson said of the Zemek Zedek's work, Or Hadera, that it contains all the previous and future teachings of the Chabad Rebbes. Noted students Rabbi Hillel Parishe Rabbi Schnorr Zalman Fradkin of Lublin Works Or Hadera, Chasidic Discourses Sefer Halakudim, a Chasidic Encyclopedia Derek Mitzvasecha, an explanation of the mystical reasons for the mitzvos Responses Zemek Zedek 8 vols. Sefer Chakira, Derek Amuna, Exposition of Jewish Philosophy. Topic. Notes Topic. External links A brief biography of Rabbi Menachem Mendel, the Zemek Zedek. The Zemek Zedek and the Haskalah movement in Hebrew. The Zemek Zedek family tree. Many published works of the Zemek Zedek. Hebrew.